you guys, Random's here. We're seeing Dune real quick. We're a little late. We're gonna keep going. He's already seen the film. Abel, Chris, uh, haven't, me and him haven't seen the film. He hasn't even seen the trailer. I've seen a bit. Just seen like the Doom Worm and some bald guy, but predictions going in. Sci-fi, I think more story than action. So like 007 I've seen. He's already seen the film, uh, but he's gonna see it in theater, so a different experience. Uh, we gotta go quick. We're just gonna say little comments um, or uh, any comments they have to say, and then we'll go to the uh, number. I think I'm gonna come out with a seven out of ten. I'm pretty strict. We'll see, Chris. What do you think you come out with? No expectations. Hopefully, seven out of ten at least. All right, Abel. He's already seen the film. Yeah. yeah so maybe you shouldn't say. Uh, I'll just keep it to myself. Just say. Do you think it. you'll keep the same number than when you see that? I say. I say. I personally like the movie when I saw it. All right. So we gotta go. Uh, any comments before? No comments? Right. No comments. We gotta go. We'll be back after we see the film. Alright, we just saw Dune. Um, I'm still trying to soak it all in. Uh, where do we start? Where do we start? Um, You're generating, I guess. Well, I try. I have a bad memory. I try to. With the 007, I try to memorize every scene. I guess we'll just talk highlights. So, when it comes to my movie reviews, uh, I have to do it with spoilers so there's no spoiler free so um we, so what, what scene stood out for you guys the first thing that came up to mind was when the worm attacked him that near the, the rock and it actually came out no no the one before that like the first scene the worm came out to when attack they're, they're the mining the spice and then yeah they, when they're mining the spice the machine oh the big machine okay. that was the first thing that popped out to me like the last the last part the last time you see the worm he was like right there he could have just got him I don't know why I guess a rock, but I don't know. The thumper, the thumper thing. Yeah. The one that it pounds the ground. Someone set one off. It was like right. I don't know. It can. I don't know if it could see. Or I don't know. What is a worm? Is right? I'd have, have to. Fun. They only have eyes. Or I don't know. I'd have to look up the like logic the with that because I feel like it could have got him. But story. Any tropes? Cons? Uh. Long film, but. The one thing I when I first saw it that I disliked was when. Uh, Joseph, Jason Momoa's character, you know how he steals a helicopter by being the killing the three guys, and then he like scares the three off. Like the like, voice? Huh? With the voice? No. Oh no, no, no. No, no, no. When he like kills them, and then he takes the helicopter. Oh yeah, the other three don't attack him. Yeah. I was they like, just okay. run away. No. I get it. I mean, I, I, they, they try to build him up like he was like I strong, savage, the yeah. best, best, you know, best fire in the, in the galaxy, or whatever. But I mean, I guess, but I don't know. That was fine by me. Um. What else? I guess that was kind of iffy. People before I seen this movie, they told me the music, and yeah, their the music was pretty interesting. Uh, I like the music. I don't mind. I like the soundtrack. It's really, for me, it was good. The best music part <clears throat> was when it was like a blue planet at the top left of the screen. It was like whispers and all. That was I got goosebumps. One. That one was really good. Um, so they say it. You got to do like three films to appreciate this. So this was, it even said part one at the start. Yep. So, Truly. And you said two years? Uh, be two, next one comes out in two years from now. Confirmed? 2023, yeah, confirmed. Hmm. It's like, uh, cause like, uh, you know, like a lot of the stuff he was seeing doesn't happen until next, next movies, you know? You know when they're like, they're, they're like fighting the Imperial fighters or whatever like the in dreams. the sand? You know, it has, like, it has like the gold suit, whatever. That's, that's like in the next movie or whatever. So his dreams are the next movie, basically. I think his, his dreams, though, like oh, you know how he dreams of that one guy that he eventually kills at the DN. Yeah, he was supposed to be his friend. Yeah, he killed him. Hmm. What I find out now is that his dreams actually like he's he's not like hundred percent accurate. He like dreams of certain you know dreams, but they're not hundred percent accurate. They won't like always happen, and we don't really know if like when he dreams is he dreaming from himself or from other people's perspective. You I know? don't know. It's like, almost like omens. Some of them were true, like uh, like you know how he, you know how he tells that one woman that worked for the for the emperor, the ecologist, that he saw how she, her loved one died or whatever. I think so. Yeah, like he's he, he can't see dreams from other people, right? Like maybe he was dreaming from Janice, from you know, from it's not from, only from his perspective, perspective from other people, I guess. It makes any sense? For me, I'm gonna have to. Honestly, I was a bit confused throughout this. I almost couldn't hear what they were saying. I couldn't comprehend what they were saying. I'm gonna have to look like a story explanation on YouTube. I usually, I usually go for those every with every film I watch. Um, yeah. Like who? The story. I don't know. Uh, Wait, what are you confused on? Almost the whole thing. 
I was just ex- kind of confused on their like who they were. Yeah, that was that dude that flip, could fly, float around. He had, like, uh, this Baron. Hat. So Baron. Yeah, his name is Lord Baron. Lord He's from like the House of uh, of. Um, there's like three factions. He's one of the factions. Well, there's like five families. Where I don't know how many he said, but uh, uh, I don't know. Him with like the dark, the dark theme. Our main guy. It's supposed to be Darth Vader here. Somewhat, um, but like levitates, kind of floats. Yeah, his him. The third, uh, Lily, the with the blue eyes. The uh, Freeman. Uh, Freeman. 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 Fourth. Uh, you have, because you have the, the Imperium fighters who also are involved in the fight. Then you had a house, uh, Harmakin, I think. What was it called the guy in the whites? They well, were that, the whites that, was, that was the 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 Imperium. That was the the ruler. That was the. I'm really unsure. The, yeah. the black, the people in the black uh, suits were House Harmakin, like the Bautista and Lord Baron, the guy who floats. And then the guys in the white suits, the, the white armor or whatever, were from the Imperium. Yes, yeah, so at the beginning I said some bald guy. That's what I was talking about. I knew the whole Dune involved the worm in there. We've seen that. Um, after seeing this, would you want to see the second one, you guys? I am. I, I feel like it. I think I'll go for it. Uh, after seeing some sort of story explanation, scenes that stood out. Any time with the worm, that was cool. Uh, action. Have, there's light action. You kind of have to uh, like, I don't know. Like, the, the story is very more dense. story. It's very st- bit dense. So like, if you have a little bit background, like from like the books or anything that you like understand a little bit more, what's going on and what's you know what's gonna happen. It's maybe the first. Oh yeah, I was, I was surprised Javier Bardem, underrated. I was surprised he was in this. I like Javier Bardem. He was uh, near the end. Yeah, he's um, one of the Fremen. Ah. Uh, also, I don't know if you catched it, but uh, when I talk about desert power, you know how they, the Fremen were like were able to like uh, like ride on the backs of the the worms. They yeah, saw yeah. It at the end. I want to see that girl there, but they she got a couple times, but then they kill that one ecologist, and then um, yeah. Hmm. All right, with this film, honestly, I need to see a story explanation. I'm willing to see the second one. If the second well, one, I mean, if I feel the uh, same, I think the second one. Will I mean, be basically, more. it's like uh, Paul. You saw through his dreams what, what's going to happen. Yeah. Paul and the Fremen are going to go, and you know he's going to go against the Imperium. I think the second one's going to be way more action packed. Probably, I think all uh, action, all wore out. He, 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 he more like, he more story. His mom just crying. So the first one, <laughs> more story. Second one, maybe more action, and the third. Kind of a closing, or I don't know. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <sighs> read the books too, Abel. I've seen. I have, yes, I've read. I haven't really, like, really read the books, but I know general what stuff kind of happens in the books. What about you for uh, scenes that were good for me? Memorable for you? The box scene. I oh yeah, the box. box. Oh yeah. yeah. We put his hand in the box. What was the oh. logic with that? Just trying to find his, his dreams. Well, because he has like uh, he has extraordinary powers, right? He has a voice memory, you know. Can man people with the voice? He's not only a you know a highborn; he's a duke. Plus, he has like the powers of of his mom's, uh, you know, uh, heritage. Or they're called the uh, Bene Gesserits. Okay. And they're like sort of like the this world's like witches, whatever. We had another friend saying this is almost like Star Wars. When they call it uh, the voice, what they call it, it's almost like the Force. Sort of. Somewhat. Yeah. And Star Wars, he kind of does that thing, where. Uh, uh, I don't know that you can make them the do hand? something. You know, because Obi Wan, it's almost the same thing here. But uh, I really like the voice. Yeah, anytime with the voice, music, the worm, and the, I don't. You know, those really stood out. But with this film, I need to see a story explanation so I can dive into it. That's that's it. Uh, I need background info for real. I really need more on it. Uh, willing to see the second one. So maybe you'll see us three, maybe more, when we do the second one. Um, so I guess we'll wrap it up and we'll talk our ratings. So who, who wants to go first? No one wants to go first. I mean, you know I liked so, it beforehand. And I still like seen it. it. He you didn't really spoil much. Like more now. Well, he didn't spoil anything. But you said tell him what tell him what you said. You seen it uh, at home, but when you saw, saw it in theaters. Home. Yeah, well, in theaters it's just more like a more like a just. More I mean, you know, the music and the soundtrack and everything going on just you feel more in you know in like. This was standard. We didn't see IMAX. Uh, yeah. Almost wanted to, but maybe it wouldn't have been a payoff. Um, I don't know. It, 
So who wants to go first? Should I go first? I, mean, I, 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 I think like I think it's like an eight and a, eight and a half, in my opinion. Eight and a half. Yeah. Okay, eight and a half. Maybe out a nine, to be honest. I like that a lot. Any? Why? Why? Uh, for me, I think it's a it's a really good like setup for like the rest of the story. Definitely it's a setup. Well, one out of three. Sets so, up, yeah. Sets sure. the story pretty good. Uh, you know, for future uh, movies and just the whole kind of like doesn't like really deep in you know go that deep into like every like house or every like the whole world exactly, but it sets up in just exactly enough. For the future movies, definitely a setup. More. And I like, I kind of like setups to be honest, because it just, you know, gets you more uh, hype for the, the hype. yeah the other ones that come out. Chris, I said a seven out of ten. Coming seven in, out of ten. But I say it is eight out of ten. Yeah, I say 10? It, it could be better. Just a little confused at the start. I didn't know who the characters were, like th their titles, like why they were so powerful, or whatever. Yeah. But once I find that out, it probably I like it more. Get more interested. I will say another thing, uh, what do you want to call it, the art, fashion, worlds, and orchestra. Uh, well, it is like 10,000 years like in the, the future. The, yeah, I don't know, all that really looked good. Um, Alright, for me, this film is a 7 out of 10. Um, Staying at 7? 7 out of 10. Dude, you do early I need to see more. You're like, you're like IGN. IGN. I don't know. He's a movie critic. No, I don't claim to be a movie critic or anything. It's just I'm a hard, hard audience. Um, I don't know. I have a certain. Everyone has their own certain taste. Seven out of ten. Even if I get more explanation, still seven. Next film could get higher. It just when I was when I was watching it from the start, it was like okay, eight, nine, and then just later on, seven. Whoa, I feel it got better right. then. Mm -hmm. Well, they you know they built. It's a good cutoff at the very end. Um, because he goes with uh, what do they call him? Fremen. So he goes with the Fremen, and we'll, we'll see what happens after that. So there's already been books, right? Uh, I think there's like seven books, I think. Do you think they'll? So they're gonna follow the books, right? They're not gonna uh, take that twist. I don't know. Like, uh, it's kind of, it's kind of. I don't know. I mean, maybe like the first, yeah, first like two books, maybe. I'm not sure how long they follow uh, Paul's story because once after Paul's story ends, it goes into other stories. Oh, the story ends, huh? So you dead? Well, it ends at some point, right? No, something has to end, but. Uh, I feel like they kind of already showed it with his omens or his dreams. Like there's butt on the blade from him. I seen that you see that one part, He's but it could be. Him. Maybe there's a reason for it. I don't know. Well, I mean that blood, that blade's him. You know, killing the chance the end, right? Or I don't know. There's I mean, a part there's where a, he got stabbed. Like he got stabbed. By, uh, but maybe I don't know. And then there's a his mother. Or I'm not sure with the baby. And yeah. His his eyes were blue. So I'm not sure. Is that the next character? Yeah, it's reincarnated, or? right? Maybe. I'm not going to say anything because I didn't know what happens with that, but... Yeah, we'll, we'll see. Me and, me and Chris both knew to this whole Dune thing. You know everything about Dune? I don't know everything, yeah, but I know I know some general things. I, I have a little bit more in-depth with the story. You right, guys? So, anything, any last comments? I stay out of seven. I had to say what I had to say. I respect everyone who went within the film, worked on the film. Uh, when they say music was awesome, it was awesome. The art, arc, arc structure or whatever, like, it was good. 7 out of 10 is where I stay. Uh, and when it comes to the next films, um can't think of the top of my head, but they will be uploaded here. Any last comments? Uh, I don't know. I just thought Dune was really, really good. Oh, yeah. Well, another way, That's I don't really know if good. I did this with 007, but uh, I usually do my own, like, would you watch it again in movie theaters? So in this case, no. Uh, would you buy it on Blu-ray or DVD? I don't think I wouldn't. No, far not. If it came to like Netflix or somehow watch it for free, would you watch it again? I would just watch it again to understand it again. Maybe. Get a better understanding. Yes. Yeah. No, yeah. maybe. Uh, and I think that's the, the main three that I go for. But with this film, we'll see. Who's the actor, the main character? Uh, Timothy Chalamet. Hey, he's kind of cool. I'll look into him. Timothy Chalamet. Um, and that was it. We saw Dune on this day, uh, November 4th. A bit late, but this will still go up. And... Uh, as for previews, we saw Batman, and oh, I did yeah, a trailer man. reaction. Um, looking forward for Batman next year. Um, Spider-Man, I didn't do a trailer reaction, but I know everyone here wants to see Spider-Man. Yeah, Most likely. Watch Spider -Man. So you'll probably see us in Spider-Man. Although the next one will probably be House of Gucci. I don't know if these guys are in on it. I'm seeing that. So maybe we'll see House of Gucci, but this has been it. Any last comments before we end it? No, uh, like and subscribe. Uh, thank you very much. No, you can't. So, this has been Randoms. Hope you guys like, 
Comment, what do you think of Dune? What do you think of our opinions? We respect all opinions. Comments down below. We'll talk all about it. And if you're new, I hope you consider subscribing and look at the um, channel, uh, channel trailer. And we'll see you guys in the future videos to come. Peace out.